by Leo Kelly and Technology Desk Editor Media Playback is unsupported on your device media caption Watch Dave Lee gets hands-on with the new iPhone X when Apple chief Tim Cook declared the iPhone X the biggest leap forward since the first iPhone at his latest launch extravaganza. You couldn't help but wonder if he was referring to its features or its price. With the top-end model costing £1,149, customers are paying a premium to swap the fingerprint sensor for a facial scanner and the ability to make an animated monkey up emoji copy the bemused looks. In opting to refer to the model as 10 rather than X, the firm has also thrown its naming convention into a bit of confusion. Will there ever be an iPhone 9 or indeed IXOF course? That's a problem for another day. And the internet has had plenty else to chew over in the meantime. Image copyright Getty Images Image Caption Some critics believe the iPhone X makes the new iPhone 8 models look outdated CNET The two biggest questions for me focus on the iPhone X as most daring design change, ditching the home button. Will actually make the phone more convenient to use and will using your face to unlock the phone benefit you, or is it just a workaround? The Verge iPhone X may be the most powerful iPhone ever, but compared to almost any other Android flagships, it's hard to pick out a category where it leads the pack at least on paper when comparing raw specifications. But if Apple has shown one thing time and again with every iPhone generation, it's that optimization of hardware and software matter, just as much if not more. Wall Street Journal the iPhone XS new design of 5.8 inches, edge-to-edge display has raised hopes that it can reverse Apple's fortunes in China, where sales have fallen six straight quarters. Chinese consumers are more influenced by a phone's appearance than consumers in other markets, and Apple had kept the same appearance for three years. Bloomberg a $1,000 iPhone could add as much as 6% to Apple's 2018 earnings per share, but that depends on the iPhone X being a hit, and there's more competition from lower-cost Chinese competitors such as Huawei and Xiaomi, which timed the introduction of the new phones around Apple's launch to attract customers who may be deterred by the iPhone XS price. Slash gear Apple has crafted a stunning new flagship. In a time when existing iPhones were starting to look a little dare I say pedestrian in comparison to what Samsung, LG, and others were doing in hardware, the iPhone X has accelerated through and can spar with the best of them. And gadget fart did bother me a little more than expected were the bezels that run around the screen. Given that Apple's competition has done an incredible job trimming the cruft from around the displays, I can't help but feel that the iPhone XS design doesn't have the same kind of impact as, say, the essential of Samsung's recent galaxies. While the very notion of using your face as the key to your digital secrets presents some fundamental problems. It's very hard to hide your face from someone who wants to coerce you to unlock your phone, like a mugger, a customs agent, or a policeman who has just arrested you. In some cases, criminal suspects in the U.S. can invoke the Fifth Amendment protections from self-incrimination to refuse to give up the phone's passcode. That same protection doesn't apply to your face. Financial Times saw the focus today was on the innovations in the expedited. All made the new 8 look like a rather boring, plain old iPhone and the price for that has just gone up $50 as well. TechCrunch The Rex is the best iPhone, no questions, and it's quickly jumped to the top of the best phones, period. Yeah, it's going to cost you, but you already knew that. Media playback is unsupported on your device media caption watch Apple's event in two minutes twittery gaze into the iPhone and the iPhone gazes back at me Nietzsche. At Erica Sadoon I'm not sure how the iPhone X face recognition will distinguish between me with makeup and without makeup. Because the difference is real. At Candy Johnson so if you were sleeping and your girl picks the iPhone X and puts it in your face, it just unlocks it yeah lol. Thanks Apple, but no, thanks. At Drolafan Miller yo I think the leak spoiled the iPhone X keynote, but Apple also didnt do enough to show why augmented reality matters. At Tom Orenth choice is simple the iPhone X are 363 coffees. At Josh Tgerson releasing the iPhone X and 8 at the same time is strange, surely those who get the 8 will feel they've not got the latest iPhone. At MR, Iconicoth iPhone X is over a thousand dollars but I get to make myself into a poop emoji, so yeah, it's worth it. At Donald Cookie image copyright Getty Images Facebook iPhone X has facial recognition. It'll look at your face and tell you that you can't afford it.
Abamani Sainfe Saidi seems like an over-engineered fix that they were forced to include because they couldn't integrate a fingerprint scanner into the screen Nick Farina how on earth can they justify the same price in dollar s as in pound s, utterly shameful I won't be buying on that basis alone. Darren Taylor he made the H almost identical to the 7 so people would have to spend the extra money for the X and I'm sure he'll buy one even though I know what they did. Patrick Michael Media Playback is unsupported on your device media caption watch a hands-on with the new iPhone 8 Plus Reddit Apple is and the first in facial recognition by a long shot but they will without a doubt make facial recognition competitive by making it better. This is how they always work. Leprechaun the lack of any fingerprint reader could cause problems for people who either cover the face for religious or professional reasons as well as for blind people. Really hoping Apple thought about these issues. Danius 353 The iPhone home button was what made it look like a iPhone. The little round button was so iconic. Now the iPhone X looks like any other phone really especially if you put a case on it. Ehave a 4 links 2 access what are they going to call the next one Altron 195?